because I have Ryan right here with me. So let's get started with this tutorial. First, I am going to spritz my face with the um, Mario Buddy School, this cucumber and green tea facial spray. Love this as a starter of a primer. And then next, once that dries, I am going to use this Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. I love it. These two combined have been doing miracles for me. And as a basically primer, but for foundation. <laughs> so foundation, we're going with the Maybelline Matte and Poreless Foundation. And just going to dot that all over my face and blend it out with the Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. And just finishing all around. Gotta get everywhere. And uh, for concealer, I'm going to be using the Makeup Revolution concealer. A little goes a long way. <laughs> and it's only three dots underneath my eye. And you're good. <laughs> And I'm going to set in that with the Wet n Wild um, banana powder right there. It really does brighten up the eye. I did this tutorial very early, so that's coffee that I've been eating. And next, I'm going to be um, for the rest of my face setting everything with the Maybelline Fit Me powder. I think this is the lightest shade that they have. I'm just going to be using my sponge to really press it into my skin and it just blends perfectly. And then more powder, which I totally hit pen on that, is the Rimmel London State Matte Powder. I use been using this forever and I just love it to keep my oils in control. I'm just scraping with what I have. And then that is the e.l.f. bronzer. I think these are like $2. But they're really good and amazing and I love them. And next up is the e.l.f. blush palette. I'm using those two shades right there. I think this is the light one. They have light and dark and this is the light one. And they're really good and amazing and from brows using the Anastasia brow riz just to darken up my brows not really doing nothing too fancy with them and next that is the MAC painterly paint pot, paint pot in soft ochre and I'm going to prime and before even eyeshadow, I'm actually gonna do some liner, and that is, I think it's like an Ulta um, liner. And I'm just going in the waterline and a little bit underneath just for like a smudgy look, and just a little bit on the outer corner right there, just like that. And I'm using the Morphe James Charles palette, of course. Been loving this palette. And I'm just deciding what I want to go for. <laughs> so, um, first shade is Code James. And I'm just going to put that as a starting transition shade in my crease. I'm just going to 
start blending that color all over. And see, just get that first color going. And just really press it in and blend. It's a really pretty orangey shade. Next um, shade I'm gonna go in with is 10% off. And I'm just gonna go with that shade a little bit lower and just really start deepening that outer crease that I was going for. I think that is the R39 brush I'm using also. And just really blend that color. Even though these colors are like really easy to blend. And I'm going back with the first brush I used and just making sure everything is well blended. So next color is No Beans. And same thing, I'm using the same R39 brush, just wiped it off. <laughs> and just really starting and going a little bit more in on that outer corner. Just really start blending it. And just really deepening and making it like a little smoky moment. As you can see, just going back and forth. With smoky looks, I feel like you can't really go wrong as long as everything's pretty well blended. And I forgot to put, um, show you the shade, but it's just the black um, eyeshadow shade that's in there. And I'm just doing it like, you can see, just almost like a line where the liner would be, but I'm using the um, eyeshadow instead. And my camera shut off on me, so there's the look on how it's going pretty good and so um, now for the under eye the next shade that I'm going to want to use and I'm going with your kidding, which is the red shade. And I'm just going to go all the way under the eye where the liner went. Just going all the way. And I'm just going to put a little bit more liner, just so it's really deep. And next I'm going to go in with mascara, which is the L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. One of my favorites. I don't think I've used, I don't know how many times I've bought that mascara actually. <laughs> And now for the lips, I'm going with the lip score, which is chocolate covered strawberries from Jeffree Star. Really, just you know, it really helps smooth out the lips and ready for liquid lipstick. And next, I'm using the Hemp's Lip Balm, which I got in my Ipsy bag and been using nonstop. It's amazing. And now for lip liner, I think that's a Milani lip liner. I'm pretty sure it's a Milani lip liner, actually. So I'm just going to line the lips. And that is the uh, Wet Wild Liquid Cat Suit. And it's in the shade Video Vixen. 
and I'm going to mix it up with Milani and Fearless. So those two shades. So I'm going to start out with the liquid lipstick first. Just get that dark berry shade in. You can see it's a little on the streakier side, but not too bad. It really does layer really well. And so now I'm just going to go in with the Milani one just to deepen it a little bit more. They're both almost about the same color. But I just love them paired together. And I'm just fixing it again. You can see I'm laying another layer of the wet and wild one. So now for highlight, I'm going to be using, of course, face. And I did, on this one, I'm going to do a lot of highlight. <laughs> So I'm just um, spritzing. I think I used the yeah the Smashbox one first just to melt everything first. And I'm going in with a little bit more highlight as you can see. Oh, it's still a little bit wet, just a just a little bit. And I'm using the. Morphe Continuous Setting Spray and just a, a little bit more I, I really felt like a lot of highlight this day <laughs> just a light just retouch And that is pretty much the finished look right here. So pretty, like, I guess you can, you, you know, wear this every day. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please thumbs it up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, you guys.